Good to see everyone. Today we're going to be talking about how to set up a landing page for the top of your sales funnel using Wix. I'm Brandon Stiles. I'm a sales funnel expert out of Atlanta and let's go ahead and get into it. All right, here we are on the front end of Wix. So I'm using the free Wix here. I used to use Wix when I first started with websites. Uh, I've gone, I've used pretty much everything under the sun and I'm doing WordPress now, but Wix is a great place to get started, especially if you're not really interested in learning WordPress and kind of the ins and outs of that. So everything we're doing today can be used with a free Wix site. So that's good. You don't have to really pay for any of this stuff. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click into edit site and when I do that this blank page is going to pop up. So the landing page we're going to create is going to be a video landing page. So someone sees an ad or somehow or other arrives on this landing page and we want them to sign up for our sales funnel by asking for us to send them the video. Remember with sales funnels we're giving value in exchange for a valuable email address down the road, long form play. So what I like to do when I'm creating landing pages is just get the wireframe structure first. So I know I'm going to need a headline and I'm going to pick this large heading right here. I'm not going to do the page title or the site title because to me those are a little too skinny and thin. So this large heading is nice. It feels like it's got lots of breathing room. I'm going to put that at the top of the page here. I'm going to center the text here. And then I'm going to make this a little bit bigger. Let's see if we can go to 40. All right, that's a good starting point. So there is my headline set up. Next, since this is going to be a video landing page, I'm going to add a video. So you click on the plus, you find video there and I'm just going to, you could either drag over a YouTube clip, let's go ahead and do that. So I'm gonna drag over this YouTube player so you can drop one in there, just kind of propagate something random. And then next I know on this left side right here, I'm going to want body copy and some bullet points to really sell this video and show people why they should download it. So once again, add text. I'm gonna choose this paragraph right here, I like how those uh, that font looks against that headline drop it there and I'm gonna just kind of just get it close alright we're gonna finesse this in a little bit but I just wanna get it close I'm gonna make it about that big because remember we have to put a subscribe button right below that and I'm going to bring it out to about right here so I'm just going to kind of pre-fill this in just to see how uh, much space we have so let's say if I was going to do one more sentence and then I was going to do three bullet points looks perfect so we're just gonna use this stuff right here I'm gonna add some bullet points right there and that's gonna bother me that those I'ms aren't taken care of let's go ahead and fix that I'm using Grammarly right there. So Grammarly, if you aren't using it, is really cool. It saved me a lot of blog posts, uh, mishaps, and it checks your word usage, it checks your grammar, obviously, and it just pulls up those red lines and it works really well. And all you have to do is click on that and it will actually change it for you. So really, you save a lot of time. And if your sentence structure was off, it would make recommendations for that too, and it works great. And Grammarly has a free version that you can use as well. Okay, so the landing page wireframe is coming together. Next, all I need to do is add a button. So let's go over here and let's add a button. As you can see, there's lots of buttons here, but I'm going to choose this one up top. A lot of times now you're seeing these fully round kind of ovular buttons. It's a pretty modern look. I'm going to line it up all right here. Maybe see if I can make this video a little bit better bigger so those are the same size and that is kind of the wireframe for our landing page so now we just have to add the copy and we have to make it look nice because if someone came here even with a copy filled in they'd be like that looks super shady and I don't want to buy from this guy he's probably gonna sell my name to the Russian mafia and they're gonna kill me so let's go ahead and put some copy in here so for this headline I'm just going to put free video reveals how 
to get a six pack in 30 days. Now I'm going to drag this out so that it's not four lines of text. Usually you want to aim for two. Two's really good and it's not too much to read. I could even probably drag that out to one. Let's see if I can do it. All right, that looks good. I like the symmetry of that. Also, I'm going to put this in quotes. I read a uh, report at some point, and I will link it below, where it says putting headlines in quotes gives you a better conversion rate. I'm not sure the science behind that. Maybe it looks like a testimonial. It looks like someone's saying it so a human connects with it. But uh, I do it a lot. And I'm going to underline this free because nothing sells like free. Remember, we're giving away this free video. So there's the headline. I'm going to just move this up a little bit so it's not so far down. Do the same with the video. And now let's go into our body copy. So with the body copy, I want to create some intrigue. I want to show some mystery and some benefits with those bullet points. And I'm trying to sell people on giving me their email by downloading this video. So let's go ahead and jump into that right here. All right, so I'm going to write a lot of people think getting a six pack is all about diet and exercise. So why that? That is a common thought of a lot of people that to get a six pack, you need diet and exercise. But watch, we're going to shock their world right here. It's just not true. So with those two sentences, we're breaking down a lot of knowledge that people think is is correct and what you have to do to get a six pack. People are like, well, just die and work out. So already we've caught their attention by challenging their beliefs. So now we have to answer that. So I'm going to say in this video, you'll learn. That's good for that. Now let's come up with our bullet points. And let's use Grammarly to fix that to video. In this video, you'll learn. Now, with our bullet points, we're trying to think of things that save people time, save them hurt, save them inconvenience. Just, again, all trying to get them to click on that button sitting right down there at the bottom. So I'm going to write, in this video you'll learn how to lose weight without having to give up your favorite foods. Let's do two more. The secret to amazing abs without having to spend hours in the gym. So we're gonna save them time. And then the one thing you can do to keep your six pack year round, even during the holidays. So that's a problem people have too. They get with their family, it gets cold, they're bundling up, and then people put on weight. So these are three things in the weight loss arena that would be intriguing to people. So we've tried to sell them on this video. I'm going to move this up again just so it's kind of even with that page copy. And now we're going to edit this button. So when I'm creating these landing pages, I'm trying to think in my head of what the person reading it, what my prospect, my customer is thinking. So as they're reading this, they're gonna say, well, I want that video. So in my button text, I'm actually gonna change that to, I want the video. It's assuming, it's entering that conversation going on in their mind. Now all you're gonna do here is you're going to add a link. So now that we've kind of set up the wireframe for the page, we have to connect it to your email subscription service. So I'm gonna do this. I'm going to click these chains and where it asks you what you wanna to link to, I'm going to choose a light box and I'm gonna create one right now. So let's dive into that. A light box is something that when you click that button, 
uh, the screen's gonna go dim, this is gonna pop up. This is a light box. See this thing that I'm creating in? That's a light box. That's what's gonna pop up so we can collect their name and email address. Watch. So create, create now. And then I'm going to just pick something that looks really simple. So that looks really simple. And we're going to edit that. So I'm not feeling that marble background. It looks uh, a little bit cheap. So we're going to double click. And it's going to give us the option to make some changes. And I'm going to, and I'm going to select a color based on who might be using my service a lot. So because weight loss is pretty much 50-50 men and women, I'm just gonna go with a nice shade of blue there. It's not too dark. Let's customize this design a little bit. The border, let's do no border. The opacity, I like the opacity, it's good. The corners, I wanna take these down a little bit to 10 all the way around. 10 is not, as harsh as the 40 pixels and I'm not going to put a shadow there. So there is our light box. Now we just need to edit it to make it all work. By the way, to get rid of that marble border around it, you're just going to drag this up, drag this out, drag that out, and then that random marble is gone so now much more focus on this i'm going to change this to white so that it sticks out a little bit more so change the color to white and i'm going to ask the viewer where should we send your video and then i'm not going to ask for a name here you can't ask for a name remember the more form fields that people have to fill out, the more your conversion rate is gonna go down on that form. So here I'm just gonna ask for the email. So this is a Wix Get Subscribers box. Let's talk really quickly about integrating an email system with Wix. So there are two things you can do. As of this video, there are no real apps for integrating MailChimp or Aweber or ActiveCampaign, which is what I use for my subscriber lists. So you could either use Wix's Get Subscribers native platform for building your lists, or you could create a form in ActiveCampaign or Wix and get the JavaScript code and paste it in. I'll show you how to do both. First, we're just gonna sign up with this Wix Get Subscribers. So when you hover over that, you're just gonna double click it and it will pull out everything you need to set up this form. So let's just do the, finesse the design a little bit. I'm going to change the button color to maybe a red so that it sticks out because that whole page is blue. So let me finesse that red to maybe right about here, a little bit of a flatter color. There, that's a little bit nicer. Not exactly where I leave it, but that's fine for the sake of this video. Um, I've been looking around for how to get that round and I can't find it. So I'm just going to put a little border on there so it sticks out and maybe make it white um, because you want people to see and know that that's the button they need to click. So where should we send your video, email address, subscribe, all that's good. So to get all the emails sent to you so that you know where to send the videos and hopefully you could automate this, you're just going to click emails and when you get here, you can actually design the email. So anytime they submit to this, it will send them a copy of the video. It can welcome them. We're not gonna go into how to design the email today, but that is where you design the video email. In the meantime, you gotta go to settings. Where should the notifications be sent? So you would just put in your email right there. And uh, here's where you can opt to add a name to this where you can opt to ask for a phone number. Again, I'm just gonna leave the email address there. Again, you can take out the title, you can add a title, you can add a subtitle. Um, here's where you change the subscribe text. So I'm going to click again and write, send me the video, just to kind of keep a consistent uh, message. And then for the thank you message, you wanna tell people if they were successful. So you would just say, awesome. The video is on its way. 
and then that is that. So now you have let Wix know where you want your notifications to be sent. You would go here and you would design the video, uh, the email, which is going to have the video on it, and then Wix get subscribers would add whoever put their email in to your email list. And that is how you set up a landing page. If you want to click below and I am going to show you how to finesse the landing page and make it look a little bit better. But also I'm going to show you how to incorporate MailChimp or ActiveCampaign or Aweber into your Wix page so that it works for whatever email thing you're using. I'm Brandon Styles, and thanks for watching. I hope you learned how to create a landing page using Wix.